Hello guys, I'm going to talk to you about new spec rumor that this BTWN Bridgetown Holding Limited is going to bring a company named Toko Tokopedia at Indonesia to a stock market in uh, in, the, in North America. So I'm going to go through it. But before I do that, please thumbs up. Uh, share this video and please subscribe. I want to make this channel big so I can bring you more information in deep information on all the aspects that's going on and I need your help to help me in order to grow this channel and Also, I'm going to tell you that I'm not a financial advisor. Please do your own de do your diligence I'm going to through it and I the thing I find it's, it's my opinion, only my opinion. Please do your own due diligence and um, find out if you are, if you can, if you if you want to um, uh, to invest in this aspect. Because at this moment it is a rumor, rumor, and not nothing is sure about it. But uh, there is a big opportunity in it because it's really low at this moment. And if it goes up, I've, I've been investigated. Uh, I've, I've investigated this uh, company and it's really big in Indonesia. And if it goes here, then uh, I know that it's going to grow really high. It is Shopify, uh, Alibaba and uh, in front of, of uh, Indonesia and it's going really to get big. OK, um, I'm going f uh, further to explanation about this company. OK, this Bridge Holding Limited, as I said, it is not uh, sure that they are going to merge with this uh, uh, Tokopedia, but there are some signs that they are going to do that. Uh, for example, uh, I have this, sorry, here. Uh, SoftBank nears another vein as Tokopedia weighs sales to billionaires spec an IPO is also being mulled. Okay. Fresh of a huge win with a DoorDash initial public offering, the SoftBank Vision Fund has another big potential payout brewing with a possible exit in the works for uh, Tokopedia, an Indonesia-based e-commerce company. The SoftBank, the SoftBank Group Venture Arm has been invest, uh, invested in Tokopedia since 2013 and uh, remains one of the largest investors in the company, which, according to Crunchbase, has raised a total of 2.8 billion. Okay, so this is that is the rumors going on at this moment, and uh, yeah, most likely they are going to uh, acquire this uh, Tokopedia. And if it go if it goes through, I'm sure that it's going to uh, get really big. Okay. Uh, before further ado, I'm going to go to the sites of Tokopedia to see what kind of company it is that we are interested in. Okay. It is. It is a company, uh, the same as in in North in North Europe, the same as uh, Wish or Aliexpress or Alibaba That's, that is e-commerce for uh, for Indonesia and you see here that they have 98 98 percent rich district rich in Indonesia Indonesia is really big so they are really big as well as you see eight ninety eight percent of these uh, countries been uh, yeah they had they have a uh, market there if I just go through this here. Uh, let's, let me see. Yeah, you see here the number of people who are active users in the different places in, in Indonesia. Oh, that is, you see, 207 7 million in Jakarta, 107. 2 million in uh, Java and Timur 112 million so there are many people using this uh, this uh, app and this 
uh, it's this company products of this company okay so it's really big and you see there are more than 100 million monthly active users 9.9 .9 million merchants and merchants are new in entrepreneurs uh, in, uh, 86.5% okay and you see uh, they have a big impact on Indonesian uh, econ economy 2.999 million jobs they create they, 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 cre they create uh, 2.99 million jobs and they are competing with uh, with other companies in price 21% cheaper that was they say and they have been increasing their uh, sales 22% increase in sales and 90% sellers now enjoy digital transaction I think they have an app and via this app they are doing some these doing these transactions and they have this app BTS, BTS. I think there is an app BT, uh, BTS and to pay uh, to Pedia just uh, using this app in order to bring their products to their customers and this is the picture of their uh, uh, their merchants the journey of the Tokopedia and our merchants okay uh, okay and you see they have uh, in, in Indonesia they are uh, majority of them are Muslims so the products they have they have a Sharia market so it's really important if you want to trade there you have to have somehow uh, Islamic roots in order to be accepted there so it's really important and they are a marketplace over 40 million products listed with uh, transparent pricing and vintage and payments okay and then you have here uh, other innovative aspects of their uh, products so they are really good in the market uh, in Indonesia so I think it's really good good idea when they if they are if the merge uh, takes place then it's going to really be big I hope you enjoyed this video please uh, share this video thumbs up and subscribe uh, I'll be uh, looking for more videos and more information about different uh, specs and I hope you enjoy this one until next video bye